run from the truth. Step into the shadows! The play itself, the assassin, is for uh, players that want to get up close and personal, but not from a direct attack, actually flanking from opposite ends of the map. She's super mobile. Uh, she's super good at getting in, getting out, and doing a whole bunch of damage, but she's really squishy, so you got to be careful. You can't take any kind of head-on confrontation. You go in, grab the objective, sneak up behind someone, slash them up, jump out of there. She's really fun to play. My favorite move to pull up with the assassin is actually the grapple attack combo, where I get behind an enemy player, I grapple to them, start dicing them from behind, and then taking them out. One of the things you can do with the assassin that is a really clutch play is let the enemy knock the shield down on the battery, and then throw the flux grenade down right as they're about to grab it, knock them away, swoop in, and steal it. You have intercepted the battery. My favorite move to support my teammates was to actually use the flux grenade. So if I see an enemy enforcer about to use his rockets against uh, one of my teammates, I'll actually throw the flux grenade at my teammate, which causes the enemy rockets to actually fly away from the target. One of the things you can do to support your team with the assassin is actually use her frenzy ability to see where people are through walls, and then you can relay that information to your team and plan an attack. A pro tip for uh, established assassin players, I would say, is that once you've actually grappled in the air, make sure that you switch from your swords to the Romerus uh, weapon very fast, because then people were expecting you to actually hit them with swords when you actually have a charged Romer shot just waiting for them. With the assassin, I would recommend swinging high and then dropping down behind people and tearing them up before they know what happens. You should play the assassin class if you're the kind of player who likes to play like a rogue in previous games, who likes to be like glass cannon full of damage, and like to sneak up on any players and really take them out very fast. You should totally play the assassin if you really like high mobility, high risk reward type gameplay. She's got a ton of tools in her toolbox. Uh, and she's just a ton of fun to play.